Well, alright guys, so welcome back to Gamer Today. Today we have a lot to talk about, everything from the season event for season 5, and basically what's going to happen in season 6. We're going to talk about the theme of season 6, and everything in between. So make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, let me know in the comment section down below throughout this entire video, your opinions on what you think is going to happen. But let's get into it guys, so first off, has the event been cancelled for season 5? Yes and no, it's kind of a bit of a two part answer to this, because it has been cancelled in one way, it's basically different than we expected, that's all, the zero point's not going to explode in any way, however something drastic is going to happen. It's not going to explode like we might have predicted. We also won't be seeing this event with a bunch of other people at the same time. It's going to be a solo experience once you update your game to Season 6. When you update the game, you're basically going to come in and you're going to experience the event and it's going to be a totally solo experience, much like the Galactus event or even the beginning of Chapter 2 Season 1. You know how we basically played a game with bots? Kind of like that, but it's not going to be a game with bots. It's just going to be a solo experience, kind of like an adventure type game or basically a 3-5 to five minute kind of thing that you're going to experience before getting into the new season. Now I understand a lot of you guys might be very disappointed to hear that because a lot of you enjoy the live event, however there's a lot of people who try to get in on these live events who can't. That's why Fortnite and Epic Games are trying something different. They tried it with the Galactus event and now they're trying it even more different with this event coming up. It'll be the first time in Fortnite history they've actually done this, if you don't include the beginning of Chapter 2 Season 1. This is an example of when an event is more interesting than it is exciting because guys you can do this event any time. So if you download Season 6 basically or update the game later on, maybe it's a month into the season, you'll still be able to play this event. You'll still be able to experience it for yourself, which is interesting. So anyone who updates the game to Season 6 has to play this event before they can play the game. It's interesting. It's kind of like an uh, interactive video, if you will. You will be actually doing something in the game of Fortnite, but it's more like an interactive experience. It's kind of like a solo game experience. It's very strange, very weird, but it's uh, kind of interesting. I wouldn't say exciting, but interesting for sure. Now, guys, let's get into what we know about Season 6 so far. So far, all we know is there's going to be something to do with DC Universe. We know that Batman's going to play a big part of it, and I'm kind of confused by why. In Season 10 or Season X, we already knew about Batman being in the game. He was actually purchasable as a downloadable skin, which we already kind of got. And honestly, it's kind of weird, because if you already have the skin, why would you want this Battle Pass? But guys, it's going to be a little bit different than that. I'm 100% sure that we won't see Batman in the Battle Pass. Not exactly Batman, anyway. I think we'll end up seeing some Fortnite character transformed into Batman with some sort of a Halloween costume or something like that. I really don't know. It could be nothing Nothing to do with Batman in the Battle Pass at all, however Batman's supposed to have some impact on the story. How? I have no clue. Something to do with the Zero Point and bring him in with the rifts that basically the rift gun that uh, Jonesy has. I really don't know more than that. That's all I've been told through developer basically leak and also what I've been hearing through other people's videos on YouTube. Now I did confirm some things with my contact through Epic Games and he did say that that part is true, that Batman will impact the next storyline of Season 6, but he wouldn't go into more details on how. So I'm really up for grabs on this. I really don't know more than that. I've been seeing a lot of YouTubers actually talking about Jurassic Park coming to the game of Fortnite. It's not happening guys, not anytime soon, and honestly Jurassic Park is dead. It's now Jurassic World, Jurassic Park is a dormant franchise, Jurassic World is still going on. So I mean it could happen but I highly doubt it, and again I've had a developer actually tell me personally that Batman will play an impact on the story. So in that regard I don't know what more to say other than Batman somehow will impact on Season 6. But anyways guys, I want to hear from you guys, what do you think is going to happen in Season 6 in the comment section down below? What do you think the event's going to be like? I was told a little bit more details than that, but I didn't want to go into it too much in this video. But let's talk about one thing, guys. If you have noticed the zero point, it's actually making some goofy noises, and if you actually do go up there, you can actually get like an emote going, and it'll basically stop the emote and make this weird, warm noise, and actually kind of throw you off. It like slows down the emote, and almost like turns it off, and then turns it back on. Kind of weird. The zero point's not going to explode. I did get confirmation on that. Something's going to happen with the zero point, but not an explosion. So it's something different. We don't know more than that. That is all I confirmed. That's all I know so far. Anyways guys, hopefully you did enjoy the video and if you did, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below. Did this video help you? And if it did, let me know. I'm curious. Anyways guys, until next time, it's been Gamer Today.